Hi, welcome to Linux Help Tutorial. Today we are going to discuss about MPStat monitoring tool. So MPStat it is used to monitor the CPU utilization on your system. It will become more useful when you are using multiple processor. If you have, if your system have multiple CPU means it will be list the all the CPU status information. Let me see how to use the mpstat command. Now the first command mpstat without using any option, it will print the whole average activities of the CPU. After under this command, hit enter. So now your activities of your CPU will be shown here. Here I mentioned what kind of architecture and how many CPU will be presented. So currently in my system, I have only one CPU. If you have multiple means, it will be mentioned here. So this is the command without using any option. Now the next command to print the all CPU static information. Suppose if you have multiple processor in your system means this command will be suitable for you. Now the iPhone P stand for processor number. Here you should enter your number or CPU number. So I am going to list all CPU. So then that, that's why I mentioned all. After enter this command, hit enter now. So your all statistics will be shown here. So in my system, I have only one CPU. That's why I mentioned in one. So if you want to display your specific CPU means you should enter that CPU number. So I'm going to enter my CPU number as zero. So this is my CPU number. If you have multiple CPU means the first CPU will be mentioned as zero number. So that's why I mentioned here zero. If you have multiple CPU means you should enter that correct number. If you have three CPU in your machine, if you want to check your second CPU means you should enter one. So after enter this command hit hit enter then you shows the output of the CPU status. Now the next command to display the CPU statics with a number of counts and a number of second with average. Let me see how to do it. So this is the syntax. So here two for two seconds and three for counts. So your CPU statics will be displayed in three counts with inter time interval of two seconds. So after enter this command, hit enter now. now. The output will be displayed. So your average our time will be average statics will be shown below. So th this is the command to check your CPU average with uh, some time intervals with some counts. Now the next command is to display the total number of interrupt statics about per second. Now this is the command to show your interrupt statics about your CPU. After enter this command, hit enter. So this is your interrupt statics about your CPU. So the another method to check your interrupt statics about your CPU is mpstat a After enter this command, hit enter. So the interrupt statics will be displayed. So the two method to check your interrupt statics about your CPU by using mpstat a The following command will use it to take the CPU static information output into text file. So after enter this command hit enter. So if you want to verify use cat and enter your text file which you have saved. After enter this command hit enter. So now your out CPU output will so now your output file will be saved into your static stat.txt file. So this is the method to monitor your CPU information and statistics by using mpstat. So that's all about this tutorial. Let me see you on another video. Thank you for watching.